I'm a lot older than I look. You know, I'm black, so you'll never know. <laughs> That's my black girl magic, huh? Ageless. Yeah. I wanted to know if there was any truth to the positive perception about black people and their skin when I looked at celebrities like Pharrell Williams, 49, Naomi Campbell, 52, Oprah Winfrey, 68, and Will Smith, 54, all of whom are aging slowly. The absolute truth is, black skin does not age as quickly as other skin types. We've watched our mothers, grandmothers, and even our celebrities age gracefully. If you are a black person and ever had someone say you look 10 years younger than you are, here's why scientifically they might be right. Point 1. Black people have natural protection from the sun. Exposure to ultraviolet, UV, light is one of the main causes of wrinkles, according to the Mayo Foundation. Dark skin repels harmful UV radiation. And the darker you are the more radiation you repel. UV radiation breaks down the fatty layers of your skin giving people wrinkles and age spots. This not only reduces our risk of unsightly wrinkles but decreases our risk of skin cancer as well. Point 2. Black people literally have thick skin. The skin is made of different layers. We have the dermis which is directly underneath the outer layer. The dermis is responsible for the support, suppleness and elasticity of the skin. It is composed of several elements like water, elastin, fibroblasts, collagen and glycoproteins. The thicker the dermis, the less pronounced the signs of aging. Black skin is known for having a thicker dermis than white skin, which helps us to look younger. They have a higher concentration of melanin. Melanin is a pigment made by skin cells. The more melanin the skin contains, the darker it is. Melanin concentration in the skin is the most significant difference between people with black skin and Caucasian skin. It is higher in people with dark skin. This high concentration of melanin provides protection against UV rays and therefore against photoaging. Their faces aren't as prone to bone loss. Aging doesn't just affect the skin. The bones in our faces decrease in density as we get older, and that can affect the way we look. However, changes to the bones and structure of the face were less dramatic among black subjects than among white participants. According to a study by researchers from Rutgers New Jersey Medical School and Yale School of Medicine, suggests that black people may experience less facial bone loss over time. Researchers claim that black people tend to have a beneficial arrangement of collagen in their skin. Collagen bundles in black skin are more compact and arranged in a way that helps to maintain structural integrity and youthful appearance for longer than white skin. This means non-black people experience early loss of connective tissue. Connective tissue contains collagen, which helps the skin stay firm, supple, and elastic. As a person ages, Collagen levels decline, leading to thin, structurally weak skin. Loss of collagen can also contribute to wrinkles. This may seem a funny point, but trust me it's one of the reasons whites age so quickly. Some Caucasians may look old for their age because they spend summers in the sun trying to achieve that dark colored tan skin. Those who stay out of the sun are likely to look younger than their age. Although you are genetically lucky in this respect, this does not exempt you from taking care of your skin. Preserve this gift of nature by choosing products that are healthy and adapted to your skin. Remember to apply sunscreen in case of sun exposure. And note this, though black skin may deal better with the sun, it is prone to discoloration, dark spots, and pigmentation such as melasma from sun exposure and hormonal effects so take good care of yourself. Mm -hmm.